My name is Jennifer and I'm an admissions and recruitment coordinator at Portland Community College and welcome to the presentation. Today I'm going to talk over the benefits of attending PCC. Whether we're your first choice or third choice of college, we want you to have the information to make an informed decision about what college is right for you. And as this year has taught us, we need to plan for the unexpected. So keep your options open and consider applying to PCC. Today I'll cover topics like why PCC could be the right college for you, who's qualified to attend, what programs we offer, and how much it's going to cost to attend. And then if you're interested in applying, we'll go over the next steps to becoming a PCC Panther. There are many reasons to attend PCC. First, many students come to PCC for the convenient locations. With four primary campuses and seven centers in the Portland metro region and online classes, it's easy to get to class and log in and do your homework and classwork wherever you live. Second, we have a wide variety of programs you can study, from general studies to a transfer degree, from veterinary and technology into early childhood education. You can either earn a degree at PCC and go to work or start your educational journey if it looks like it will be a bachelor's degree. Another great reason to attend PCC is affordability. At a fraction of the cost of a four-year university, you can start your studies without as much financial stress. We also offer a lot of leadership and work opportunities on campus that can even further relieve the stress of finances. We have an amazing and diverse student body and staff. We are proud to put equity and inclusion at the top of our priorities in regards to providing a good education. And we have really small class sizes. Usually you won't have any more than about 25 other students in your class. And that means that you would get attention from your teacher and be able to communicate with them and ask questions without any pressure. Students come to PCC to accomplish a variety of goals. Many students are hoping to earn a bachelor's degree or even higher, but they want to start closer to home and at a more affordable rate. Many are hoping to learn a skill or trade and get a well-paying job after a two-year college degree. Some students just aren't sure what their career goals are and so want to explore their options without paying a higher tuition rate while they figure it out. Some are here to earn their GED or high school diploma, and others are here to learn English as a second language. As you can see, we welcome students from all levels of academic ability and goals. There are two primary paths our students will take. The first path is to start taking classes at PCC on the way to earning a bachelor's degree or higher. Students plan to transfer to a university after a year or two of taking classes with us. There is a wide range of majors students seek in this path, including psychology, writing, music or art, or social work, just to name a few. The other common path students take at PCC is to earn an associate's degree or certificate in a skill or trade. Students will receive focused, hands-on education that prepare them for the workforce. Majors in this type of field can include graphic design, nursing, welding, automotive technician, or dental hygiene. There are so many majors you can choose from here at PCC, so I encourage you to go online and check out the full list. Coming to college can feel daunting at times, and so we provide a lot of resources to help you through your journey. And they're all available online. For example, we have a wide variety of free tutors to help you in your coursework. If you have an IEP in high school or need accommodations in the class, like longer test times or more um, additional technology, our Disability Services Office can help you. And we have a wide variety of peer mentors and licensed counselors to help you when you might be feeling a little overwhelmed or stressed. And if you want even more out of your experience than just your classwork, 
we offer another wide variety of leadership opportunities, like our honors program for additional courses. You can serve on our student government. You can get a campus job and we offer internships. All of these services can help you gain confidence, work experience, and make a few friends. If you're concerned about what kind of job you'll have after you get out of PCC, our Career Services Center is for you. They will help you while you're at PCC and after you graduate with resume writing, job finding webinars, interviewing practice, and they'll help you figure out which university you want to transfer to based on your major. We also offer work study jobs on campus to increase your resume and your job experience. And we have a lot of partners that are businesses here in the Portland area and Oregon that can help you find a job. For instance, Intel, Hoffman Construction, and Portland Public Schools, they all look to PCC for graduates to hire. Although we don't have campus housing, we still have an incredibly vibrant student life. We have a multitude of student-led clubs. And if you don't see one that you're looking for, you can start one yourself. Serving on our student government is a great way to make friends, stay active, and have a voice in your community. Many times our student government are the ones that decide how to spend part of the PCC budget, which is a big deal. They can also go down to Salem to talk to government officials, and they help build college policy. And don't worry, this isn't just a popularity contest like it might have been in your high school. It's about making real change in your community. We have so many campus events as well, like a powwow, uh, fun runs, job fairs, the great Cascade African Film Festival, Semana de la Raza celebration, and Cultures East. We have a men's and women's basketball team and soccer teams, and a number of resource centers to get involved with, like the Queer Resource Center, Women's Resource Center, and Veterans Resource Center, just to name a few. At PCC, tuition is charged based on the number of credits you take. For example, in the 2020 school year, one credit can cost an in-state student around $150 for tuition and fees. If you are a part-time student, around six to eight credits and attend a full year, this will come to about $2,250 for tuition and fees. If you're a full-time student, which equates to 12 credits or more, that's roughly about $5,500 for the year. Our books can range anywhere from $100 a year to $700 a year, and potentially free based on the book that your teacher is requesting. PCC can offset these costs with a variety of options. First, I highly encourage you to complete your FAFSA or ORSA application every year you go to college. This is needed in order to receive federal and state financial aid. And sometimes it's required for scholarship applications too. And of course, if you plan to come to a community college, apply for Oregon Promise. This is a grant for students who are graduating high school or with a GED who plan to attend a community college. This can offset your tuition with a free form of financial aid even more. I also encourage you to complete the OSAC and PCC scholarship application. PCC awarded students in the amount of over $2 million this year. We want you to get some of that money. And check out our programs at PCC that also offer additional scholarships, like our really popular Future Connect program. We encourage you to check it out online. In order to apply for admission to PCC, it's pretty easy. What you'll do is an online application and it is free. There's no deadline, but we really encourage you to complete that application as soon as possible. It takes about 20 to 30 minutes to complete and we're gonna ask you pretty general information. For example, your name and address, your high school you went to, and your field of study. And of course, if you don't know what you wanna study yet, 
you can just say undecided. Thank you for your time and attention. I really hope this gives you more information to make an informed decision about your college journey. Like I said, no matter your plans, there's no harm in applying for admission to PCC, and we hope to see you soon.